Hello and welcome to C Note. In this video, we'll learn how to find the equivalent resistance of this circuit. First, let's understand how current flows through this circuit. The entire current flows through the 5 ohm resistor. Then, the current splits and flows through the 6 ohm, 9 ohm, and 18 ohm resistors. To make it easier to solve this circuit, let's label three points as A, B, and C. Now, Take a closer look at the current flow between points B and C. The current splits and flows through resistors. This splitting of current is a clear indication that the resistors are connected in parallel. We use the parallel resistance formula. 1 over R equivalent resistance equals 1 over R1 plus 1 over R2 plus 1 over R3. Substituting the values. 1 over 18 plus 1 over 9 plus 1 over 6. The total becomes 1 over 3. So, the equivalent resistance between B and C is 3 ohms. So, instead of using the 3 resistors between B and C, we can now use just one 3 ohms resistor. Now, take a closer look at how the current flows between points A and C. The entire current passes through each resistor one after the other, which means they are connected in series. In a series connection, to find the equivalent resistance, simply add the resistor values together. So, 5 ohms plus 3 ohms equals 8 ohms. That means the total resistance between point A and point C is 8 ohms. So, we can now replace the between points A and C with a single 8 ohm resistor. We simplified the whole circuit and found the equivalent resistance. So, the equivalent resistance of this circuit is 8 ohms.